Will Sylvester Stallone save the superhero genre from identity politics, gender swapping, race swapping, and name calling fans? Let's check it out. Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. This is Sporky News. My name is Scott. If you're a first time person here and you believe in, hey, speaking your mind and having debate, please subscribe, hit the like button, share. Definitely subscribe though. It helps out the channel. So anyways, uh, Sylvester Stallone has a new movie out. I just, actually it was uh, bounding into comic. I saw an article uh, that they just posted about it. I haven't watched the video yet. Um, I was actually kind of shocked about it. wanted to see if it's going to be like in the vein of superhero-ish, you know, stuff we see from Marvel or will it be like the Bruce Willis, you know, um, glass type, you know, superhero where it's more close to reality. Uh, let's take a look. I'm making no sense anyway. So here we go. This is the Samaritan with uh, prime video and They've already had over 2 million views. Holy cow. Uh, 21K likes. I do not know the dislikes, but we will take a look for ourselves. Um, let's see what we got here. All right. Wait up, wait up. What are you doing with all this junk? Keeps me busy. Another long night of crime and violence. Some say it's only a matter of time before huh. the city implodes. Looks like a couple summers ago. Oh! <laughs> those were kids! I think we're finished here. Go are those old kids? I found him. So realistic kind of feel. Samaritan died 25 years ago. Oh. That's what they say. Okay. You think you live across from a superhero? Do you have a therapist, kid? Oh. Kid. Wow, that dead. kid's really studying. Oh! I pick up garbage for a living, pal. Samaritan cleans up the streets. <laughs> you mind your business, I'll mind mine. I don't believe you! No! <laughs> wow. Oh. Guess no hiding in it now. Okay? Oh, cool. How strong are you? Not as strong as I once was. Things start to fall apart when you stop carrying. And I stopped carrying a long truth? time ago. How come you hate who you are? For some people, it's too late to change the damage they've done. He's hiding something. I want him dead. Really? Oh! The things you bury tend to haunt you. Why did you disappear? Okay. Is he bulletproof? Try this. Okay. When was this coming out? Hold on. What was the date on? Did they give us a date? August 26th. Wow, I'm kind of shocked that it took this long for this. For I think this is a first trailer, correct? Uh, let me know in the comments below if this has been out before this. I, I knew nothing of this. Uh, PG-13, so... You know, it's not going to be too racy, but there is a kid in the show. That kid, I want to say he was in the new season, which I didn't watch. I've only watched a couple episodes of uh, the Umbrella Academy. Uh, Diego, I think the character's name. It's his son. Um, I just, I, I couldn't. I couldn't with the Umbrella Com uh, Academy, and I really loved the first season. But I digress. Um, so I'm confused. The only thing I'm, you know, it looks really cool. Um, I enjoy the gritty, like real life, but look, he got hit by a car, broke bones, put bones back together, bruised face. But yet back here, you know, they're, they're definitely, definitely shooting at him. And if, unless they're like, you know, really bad shots and don't, 
talk about stormtroopers. They're precise. Think about Obi Wan, New Hope. Listen. Um, then he's bulletproof, but yet his bones can break. So I'd like to know more about the history of this character. I don't know if this, I have never heard of a Samaritan character before. Is this a comic book? I don't know. Like this is a blind reaction. I let it play for a little bit in the background. I was listening to the music and like the dialogue, but I, this is the first time I actually sat down and watched the whole thing. Um, I watched up to about this point right here uh, before, but it looks good. It looks good. I don't know. What do you guys think? I, we need something different in the superhero. Um, I always say it wrong, but genre. Uh, we we have too much of the Marvel formula, too much of their now agenda. And, you know, as some will say, the message. Um, also, the playbook, which I have quoted copyright soon, um, where they know their series or movies going to suck after the first trailer. So they attack the fans calling them all istinisms so that when the show does come back out and we complain about the show, well, we're all bigots and sex sexist and all homophobes. And you know how that works. I, I want to see change in the, the superhero genre. I want to see it grow. I want to see it progress Movies have always different Westerns went from, you know, the John Wayne's and the high noons to the spaghetti Westerns. And they just, they grew, um, gangster movies, you know, in the thirties and forties and fifties, then grew into the Godfather and then into Goodfellas and things like, and then even, you know, uh, different nationalities, Scarface and things like that. So right now we're stuck. And I felt like DC wanted to go that route and change like, what we expected and they did with the Joker. They tried with the Batman. Um, but this looks like something closer to, like I said, the Bruce Willis movie, uh, unbreakable. Um, not the boys. That's still a little campy. This doesn't look like it's going to be that way. Um, not about the corporate over, you know, overreaching and, and government stuff. Um, this looks like a story of a superhero Something terrible happened. He faked his own death. Uh, and now he's going to have to come back to save a neighborhood. And I'm down with that. I know the story isn't new, but maybe they'll do it in a new way. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think below. Uh, tell me if you like these type of videos. I don't always have time for videos. We mostly do um, live streams on this channel. Wednesday nights is the Mad Dump. Saturday nights is becoming something special with The Dump with some great YouTubers. Uh, we're kind of a big deal. Uh, and then Mondays for right now, we're doing aluminum spork, which is uh, conspiracy theories and UFOs and ancient lost history. But soon as house of the dragon starts right around the corner, we're going to switch over to that for a couple months and then go back to aluminum spork. We'll have seasons of it. But, uh, yeah, again, please let me know what you guys think down below. Remember like share, subscribe. It really helps out us small content creators. And I wish you all a great day. Have a good one. Everybody.